Happy Friday, beloveds. In just a moment, you are going to hear a brief clip of Katya Kravitz playing our beacon organ. There'll be more to hear this Sunday at 9.30 and 11, virtually or in person. Music has been for me, and I suspect many of you, a real bomb over the last two and a half years. And I have so much gratitude for Misa Iwama, our Director of Music Ministries, and all the ways in which Misa has kept us singing. I give thanks to the choir who has learned how to sing over Zoom, hold virtual rehearsals, and at last this past Sunday, they were back in our sanctuary at Fort Waldron. Music is for so many of us, a way in which we rejoice, we mourn, we wonder, we remember. There have been many a night where I have held a child of mine and picked a hymn or song that I heard at Beacon to bring comfort. There have been quite a few times when there is something I wanna celebrate and I select a song that we have shared together. I give thanks for the creativity that John O'Neill and Misa have exercised over these last two and a half years, pretty much becoming sound engineers overnight. And all of the guest musicians, including Vicki Carter and Jackie Jones, Rosina Hill Jackson, that have also gotten creative, singing from the balcony. We sang outdoors, even if it was a bit cold, because singing matters to the well being of our souls and our community. So keep on singing, Beacon. Keep on singing.